Hello there and welcome back to another video and today I'm going to be on, not unboxing, I'm going to be reviewing um, the special edition of Remembrance of the Daleks. So let's get into it. So a few years ago, probably two or three years ago now, I uh, did a review of Remembrance of the Daleks. But now as um, courtesy to the season 25 box set, um, there's a new special edition version. So um today i'm going to be reviewing that um so what can i say about this um it is one of the best stories i think of the um sylvester mccoy era uh, i love uh sort of like the dalek civil war idea and my favorite dalek very the special weapons dalek is in this so it gets bonus points for that um i really love um Sylvester McCoy and Sophie Aldred in this, they're probably my, one of my favourite classic Doctor Who, Doctor and Companion pairings. I think they just work so well from the first story. Um, and as well, it's got updated special effects with this, which um, look really good. Obviously not how they would would have looked in 1988, but... Um, it adds so much more to the story and it makes it a lot more real. Like when Scarrow blows up, um, it turns it into like a supernova. And um, uh, all the dark dar laser beams, I think, it just makes the story so much more better. And um, using, replacing like the model shots with um, like CGI creations of the Dalek spaceship, I think. It, it just adds like a, another layer to the story. But also, with this box set, we have, um, with the special editions, it adds new footage from uh, previously deleted scenes or lost footage. Uh, so, uh, in in this set, we have stuff like an extra two or three minutes added on to the cafe scene in episode two, I believe. Um, and that extra two minutes may not seem like a lot, but when it plays out on screen, it really does feel like a lot. Um, it adds so much more to the ep to the episode and uh, loads of the other little bits that they add in um, really doesn't seem out of place. They look so good. And that um, coffee shop scene is probably a 10 out of 10 um, scene. One of my favourites. And this this episode with the updated special effects, which is always the way I watch these with um with the new box sets. If uh, there's a story with updated special effects, I watch it that way. Um, and I think the the way the way they've done it, it adds so much more to the story, and it makes this story go from a ten out of ten to like eleven, twelve out of ten. It is so so good. Um. Now let's talk about um, the actual plot of the story. So the Dalek Civil War, um, I think it's such a great idea setting it at school. When I first saw this, um, when I was like six or seven, uh, I I imagined, oh, wouldn't it be good if there was a Dalek Civil War going on in my school, in like the school holidays or at the weekend? And I know probably I'm not the first child to think of that. So. Uh, I thought that's a really smart idea for them to do it that way. Um, my favourite standout moment from this story is the cliffhanger to part two, I think, or part three, uh, where Sophie Aldred beats up a base, uh, baseball bat, beats up a Dalek with a baseball bat. Um, I love that scene so much. And um, I think even though it was created almost 40 years ago now, um, it would it still holds up so so well and with the updated special effects it just adds a new lease of life to this episode um and has, i think this is probably now has taken over the keeper of charkin for my favorite classic doctor who episode um this i highly recommend if you can try and get your hands on this box set to watch the special edition first because uh, what i do is I don't watch any of the stories from that season for a while so I can get a new perspective on them for the box set. Um, it, and yeah, uh, it's just, I, I, I'm lost for words of how good this story is with the updated special effects. Um, 
I can't really speak for the other stories, but I know all of them do have some sort of updated special effects. And I think they all have some deleted scenes that have been taken out, um, broadcast for timing reasons, and now they've brought, been brought back in. I think they've done that for all of the stories, but I'm not too sure. And I think all of the other supporting cast are really memorable. Um, so you have Group Captain Gilmore, um, uh, Mike, played by um, Dursley McClendon. Beautiful documentary on um, him in this box set. Made me cry so much. It's really emotional and heartfelt documentary. It, it is really, really good. Um, but and I think it's hard if you're a supporting cast member to sort of make your role memorable to the audience. And I think they definitely did did that well. And it's a very good sort of unofficial 25th anniversary special. Um, so yeah, that's it for this video. Um, let me know what you think of this story in the comment section down below and hit the like button and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.